Here comes the sun for solar energy in Maryland. A new movement in Annapolis would make panels like these a more common sight, especially for utility companies. Utilities are required to do a little bit of solar now, and this bill would add a little bit uh, to what they're required to do in the years uh, to come. The new plan would put pressure on energy companies to use a higher percentage of solar power faster. Current state law mandates that power providers use 2% of solar power by 2022. The new regulations would increase fines for late adopters of solar. But there's an incentive for utilities to act now, not later. On a nice day like today, Maryland receives over 196,000 gigawatt hours of energy from sunshine. That's more than all the output of all the power plants in Maryland combined for an entire year. But the bill hasn't gone without opposition. For Senator E.J. Pipkin, increases in solar penalties don't add up. You know, what else can you call it but a tax? The government sets an unrealistic goal for solar production. It has penalty fees that the consumer ends up paying, yet they have no say for this billion dollar taxation. Still, environmentalists hold out hope. This would be a big step forward for clean energy in Maryland. That will have us seeing the light. Pete Muntean, CNS-TV.